seed and we are ready to go. Just really simple, comfy travel look. This is the part we wanted to show you. So the best part of you being away is the coming home. So cute. <laughs> and we are ready to go. I have a feeling today's vlog will be a little bit on the shorter side just because I've been running around getting ready you know when you're going on a trip there's always like last minute bits to do so yeah that was me today but we had a pretty nice morning I was editing we ordered breakfast so half chill half crazy but I'm pretty much ready to go I can't believe it and um, I think we're gonna leave around quarter past three and it's just three now so I'm dressed pretty comfy and casual just black jeans um a camel jumper camel coat my Chanel belt and black boots I tried to wear some of the heavy bits going I'll Turn around and show you. Okay, it's pretty dark, but hopefully you can see. Just really simple, comfy travel look. Um, the reason I'm wearing heeled boots is because <laughs> it's better to wear them because my case, I have a feeling, could be overweight, but we'll see. Um, Tommy's coming home at the weekend, so I did leave a few of like my bigger pieces with him, like coats and stuff. Oh my god, they're so big and heavy. I want to bring my Ghani coat, but it's almost like too big to wear traveling. It'll be annoying on the plane, but it's also too big to pack in my case. So, Tommy, the angel that he is. I was going to bring it in his suitcase for me. Um, boys are so lucky. They hardly have anything. I'm very like trying to decide between certain things but anyway they'll all get there in the end and I probably won't wear half the stuff but what's new. But this is me anyway. Just going to wait for Kill to come now in the Uber and then we're off to Ireland. I'm sure I had two big suitcases last year and a small case and my hand luggage so I think I'm doing pretty well this year. Um, just one bigger case and I think it could be okay. Tommy thinks it's okay but we'll see soon. Hand luggage I always put like my shoes and my bags and like my valuables into that and then then my Saint Laurent like travel bag is so handy. I have my laptop, um, camera, like techie kind of stuff, notebook because I'll be editing on the plane. So it's handy to have them all together. And that's everything. Are you going to miss me, Tommy? <laughs> um, our tree is kind of falling apart. I think Tommy's probably going to throw it out before he leaves. So sad to leave it, but it served us well and it made the place so cozy. Find me on route, we're in the taxi. Kayla just picked me up. It is the rainiest, rainiest day ever in New York. I'm happy to be getting out here, but I did hear that the weather is kind of bad in Ireland too, so we shall see, but we're gonna head to the airport now and I will check in when we get there and let you know if my bags are okay. God. Two kg under. She thinks there's gonna be is there's gonna be heavier. No. We shall see. Guess whose bag was heavier? Barely. <laughs> okay, just sitting down and just in case you're interested, this is the travel food that I got, which is so not healthy. I was really thirsty, so I got a Sprite. I was just craving something like fizzy. I'm never, I never really um, usually drink these, but one of those days where I just wanted it, got some water, and then not everyone likes these. I think, Kel, you hate these. Is it you that hates them? I really like them, yeah. yeah. I love them. It's like a random bag of all these different kind of um, snacks. Unreal. And then I saw these. Did you see these, Kel? Caramel, M&M, &M. yeah. I was going to get the other blue basket, but it said pretzel on them. So I'm oh sure no, they used to be the crunchy ones. I'm, um, I've never had these before, so I'll let you know how they are. So that's my travel snacks, and then God knows what else is in this bag. My chargers, adapters, literally threw things in in the end. Passport, I actually love my passport holder so much. I've had it for so long, it's from um, Henry Bendel. Just a really simple one, but it's lasted so, so well. And then I have like matching, um, what you call it, laptop uh, holder, and there was also a card holder, but I switched that out for my, for my Chanel one that I got. So yeah, that's my travel bag, and then my phone and portable charger, which is the story of my life forever there. We're checked in, we are all set to go. Um, our bags were actually not overweight for a change, which is just fantastic, but I did give some things to Tommy, so. Mm -hmm. 
that's probably why mine was underway. This is always the best part when you're like checked in and you've everything done and you're just waiting to board. Are you excited, Ken? Yeah, getting excited now. I feel like it was two seconds ago that we were going on. Don't you think that? Oh god, I didn't even got any sound or something on Netflix. Oh yeah. Um, also, our mom texted us, Ken, show me the message. It's like the funniest thing. Well, it's not funny. It's actually very cute. Um, they'll be at the airport as usual. Vogue, I'm assuming, will be there. <laughs> um, Give me a picture of Vogue too. Let me show you that. I'll turn around and show you. Look at Vogue. There she is. Mom, mom captions you. them as if like Vogue is talking. Look how adorable she looks right there. Like, cute, cute, cute. Here, show me the message that mom sent us. Well. She looks like she's smiling at it. She doesn't really bit. smile that much. She doesn't. <laughs> this is the part we wanted to show you. So the best part of you being away is the coming home. So cute. <laughs> We're definitely so excited to come, but um, I know it always reminds me of Christmas that, you know, not everyone gets to go home and we're super grateful mm -hmm. that we do. Like, you know, when we moved away, um, when I moved away four years ago, my mom made me promise. <laughs> She's like, you can go and you can stay as away and like all year long, but you have got to come home for Christmas. And I just always like um, keep the promise, definitely. And I probably always will. She loves yeah. having us there, but you know, we totally know that not everyone gets to do it. And yeah. we're so lucky and we really are. And like. <laughs> We're lucky that we get to work now from home next week and we'll, you know, be kind of working as normal and then we'll, our Christmas will start at the end of the week. Um, but if you aren't making it home for Christmas this year, you know, enjoy where you are and like make even, it, yeah, think. make the most of it. It might be the only time you're ever away and it'll be an experience that you can look back on and then maybe next year you can make it home. So hopefully wherever you are, you're getting excited and if you're coming home, I hope you're excited and if you're not coming home, I hope you're equally as excited as well. I was just thinking about that when I was walking into the airport and they have a little arrivals place here too and like it's only a small one but it makes me so yeah. sad. Like not sad, I'm like sad. a happy sad. Oh yeah, like yeah. I can like feel it's my really eyes sad. welling up like I cried everything that's happy sad. Uh -huh. So I'm like I have to look away, I can't I'll start bawling crying like so easily. It's so no embarrassing. <laughs> but it's so nice seeing families like that haven't seen each other for a while and everything. So yeah, that is my random thoughts of the day um, but anyway we better go because I think our gate's up that way and we better not miss this flight or our mom will have a heart attack so thanks for watching as always and um, be sure to like and subscribe and keep an eye out for tomorrow's vlog which is what are you doing <laughs> so annoying keep an eye out for tomorrow's vlog and Vogue will be making the appearance sure will I can't wait to see her at the airport send some requests if you want to see anything special at Vogue yeah okay um, okay we better go so thanks for watching and see you in the next one bye, bye.